Hey, how's it going everybody and welcome back for some more of Assassin's Creed 2 and I've kind of gotten myself in a little bit of a tussle with these guards here So I'm gonna go ahead and kill them I was chasing a thief guy because he ran away from me and he has money on him So I need that money. Well, I don't really need it, but it's fun to loot corpses So I killed him and damn it there are more guards here But basically what the plan is is to well first let me explain things I was recording and I recorded for about 10 minutes and then I noticed that my audio waves and audacity to my right on my other monitor we're looking all weird, so then I decided to stop the recording and see what the deal was. And it turns out I was recording with the wrong mic. The Audacity just decided to uh, switch to my webcam mic. I don't know why it did that. Kind of annoying, but sometimes Audacity will do that, and usually uh, I catch it before you know recording or whatever. But I didn't this time. So now you guys lose out on one of the assassinations of the Potsy conspirators. So you missed out on that because I would revert to the save and just record and. Blah, blah blah everything would be fine but because uh, this game auto saves it auto saved after I killed that guy so now I can't revert back to that because the game decided to never roll back on saves anymore like it just deletes all of the previous auto saves uh, when I play the game now so that's great really poopy to be honest I, it upsets me because you know now I can't show you guys that assassination but basically he got mad they had to kill a bunch of archers and then kill him and uh, he got mad. He's like, back away, demon. And Ezio was like, don't disrespect death and blah -de blah But that's where we're at. Uh, now I'm trying to find this viewpoint, which is like right over here. So we'll go ahead and climb this thing, get a viewpoint of the city, and then we'll kill the other Potsy conspirators and then kill Grandpa Potsy. And then revenge will be exacted, or exacted, if I can pronounce that correctly. And uh, then from there we can move on to hunting down the fat Grim Reaper and all the other assholes that are committing stuff, committing crimes, atrocities, whatever. The random bullshit that they do that is bad. You know what I'm talking about. God damn it. There's like no way to climb this tower, is there? Is there a way? Oh, wait a minute. I see one. I see a way. What the fuck, Ezio? You're not climbing onto shit when I tell you to. Climb onto this. Yeah, there you go. That's what I'm talking about, Ezio. I have to grab onto this thing. There's a guy over there. He's going to like start throwing shit at me soon. Yep. He's probably about to start throwing shit. No, you ass. Don't throw shit at me. Oh, what the hell? He like just stopped caring after he went all the way to the red zone or whatever. All right. Makes things easier on me. I don't care, but I've decided against doing Brotherhood and this game before Assassin's Creed 3 comes out. Now, let me explain. Basically, the way things are going right now, I think the schedule for the channel is going to be too hectic because there's going to be a shit ton of new games coming out very soon, and I don't want to try and get this game done and Assassin's Creed Brotherhood done because I feel as though I'd be rushing through those games. Uh, well... Not this game. I want to try my best to take my time with this one. But, yeah, I basically would have to rush through this game in order to get to Brotherhood and get that game done before Assassin's Creed 3 comes out. So that's where I'm at. There's also a bunch of other games that I plan to start soon. What the fuck was that, Ezio? You should have countered that one. That shouldn't have been any kind of problem. I don't even know why these guys were chasing me. Like, what did I do wrong? Okay, whatever. They're all gonna die. Not a big deal. It's not a problem. But, um... So yeah, like I, I wish I could get Brotherhood done before Assassin's Creed 3, but eventually I will get all those games done, so it's not even a big deal really. I do want to do Assassin's Creed 1 as well at some point. Uh, not exactly sure, 100% sure, but I feel as though uh, it could happen. It, it, like it's likely. If, if it turns out that I don't have much going on with the channel after I've done 3 and I've done all the other new games that I want to do that are coming out soon. Um, excuse me. If, they, if all those games are done and I've got nothing going on, then I'll happily do Assassin's Creed 1. But it really depends on what's going on. So That is where I stand. I have some uh, other new projects that I want to start soon, like the uh, Mass Effect 3 trilogy and a couple of new Minecraft series that will be coming out very soon. Uh, just haven't decided exactly when they will be started. And also, like, other just various stuff that's going up. Um... Plus all the new games, as I already mentioned. But we're going to be wrapping up Dawn Guard. This game, hopefully within the next couple of weeks. I really don't know how long uh, it's going to take to finish up this game. But I'm not even halfway done, I don't think. So there's no need to rush. But Dawn Guard is going to be done. Spore is going to be done. And Lego Batman won't take very long just because it's a short game. But that's where I stand. I just want to let you guys know that Brotherhood will probably be finished after... Uh, God damn it. Get the fuck out of here, man. Brotherhood will be uh, taken care of after I have done Assassin's Creed 3 instead of doing Brotherhood first, so just wanted to tell you guys that. But, God, what? Why are they attacking me? I didn't do anything wrong. Is it just because this guy was dead next to me? You don't know. You don't have proof. Bunch of dicks, man. I'm going to kill this guy. Kill him. Kill him, Ezio. 
Just stab him right in the neck, in the ear, in the, the chest, everywhere. Ah! Ah! Oh, he's dead. Okay, good. Now we're anonymous. Now let's hurry up and talk to this guy. God damn it. Ezio, about time you got here. We found Bernardo Baroncen. Ottima notizia. Tell me where he is and I'll see that he's dealt with. That's the trap. Lorenzo actually had him arrested days ago, after being returned to us from Constantinople. But he escaped. We believe him to be somewhere inside San Gimignano. Va bene. I'll see if I can't pin him down. How do you expect to succeed where the rest of us have failed? I have my ways. Locate and assassinate that guy. Sounds easy enough. Just had to use some eagle vision, I would imagine. Shouldn't be too hard. Look at that. The green area is like right over here. We don't even have to travel across the entire city to get there. That's great. That is refreshing because I remember in like Revelations, I'm pretty sure, you had to travel to Narnia and back just to figure out where, to, where a guy was or the general area where a guy was. Now they just kind of put him right next to me. I know there are some missions in uh, this game where you have to travel across like the entire city practically to get to the area where you're going to assassinate somebody, but it's nice to see that the area in question where the guy's going to be is like right over here. And there he is. Look at him. Look at him walking around over there. And now the guy's talking to himself. If it happens, I keep moving. Never in one place for long. Only, only how to sleep. When to sleep. Where to sleep. Is he really just going to keep on talking to himself about bullshit? I think he is. What an asshole. What a complete dick about stuff he's being. Alright, not a problem. Oh, 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 and he's done. <laughs> he tried to make a run for it. What an asshole. What the hell is he wearing? Is he wearing leotards? You would come. Where is Jacobo? It's another fat guy. To him what you've done to me? There is still time for you to clear your conscience. We gather at the church when a meeting is called. Mi duole dover giungere a tanto. Requiescat in pace. He wasn't that fat. Not as fat as uh, Uberto, but he was kind of up there in fatness. Ah, what the hell? This is a lot of guards. Holy shit. These guys did a shitty job, man. They could have saved that guy. They didn't. Yeah, that guy's kind of fat. And he's wearing leotards. Like, what is he doing? <laughs> when did he think that was going to be a good idea? Yeah, whatever. Probably has something to do with the times. Because I know back in the day, when you, if you were fat, then it was like looked upon... Like, it was a good thing because it meant you had money and stuff. Or at least that's what history class told me. Those days are long ago and far away, so... That's not the, the case here. I'm, I, I happily kill him. He is happily dead. Or, well, he's not. he is not happily dead. I am happy to have killed him. I am happy to have him dead. Because it means I can advance the story. As soon as I uh, get rid of all these guards here. If I kill enough, the, the rest should run away. So that's what I'm looking to do here. I don't really feel like running away myself because that takes time and you have to climb shit and it's annoying, but we're almost there. Oh, and this guy's done. Alright, the rest of you should run away at this point. You really should. God damn it. I'm fully no uh, notorious now. That's dumb. Oh, well. I just have to kill this one guy over here who's walking towards me. And they're all done. Look at that. This guy's next. Oh, 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 you will not. Yeah, you died. <laughs> he couldn't even finish his sentence. I will not die. Blah, blah, blah. Oh, look at this uh, Harold over here. Can I talk to him? Yeah, let's bribe him. Bribe you. And then possibly kill him and then loot him for my money back. As soon as those guards walk away from me. Alright. Hey, shut up. Shut up. Just don't talk. Alright. Ezio did not kill citizens. He just did. He just fucking did. He doesn't care. That means this Harold will shut the hell up and he can get rid of some notoriety. Then it's not even a big deal. But can I climb this thing? Can you climb this thing, Ezio? I don't think Ezio wants to climb this thing. He goes on either side of it. There we go. That's what I'm talking about, Ezio. That's what you need to do. And I need to find a horse and steal it. And hot damn, that is kind of a long drop there. Kind of, sort of, but not really. Oh, actually, it didn't do any fall damage. I did not take any fall damage for that. That is amazing. Wow, there was a wagon with leaves and shit in it. That would have been nice to have. Is there a horse down here? Please let there be a horse down here that I can steal. I find it weird that you can just mount up with any horse you want and just fucking ride into the sunset in this game. Like, you don't have to buy one. You can just ride any which one you damn please. You damn well please. 509 florins. Holy shit. That was a good chest. That's right. As you advance further into the game, like, some of these chests start carrying some ridiculous items. It's kind of outrageous, to be honest, but I'll take it. 
I really don't care. Let's go ahead and climb this thing. Get this viewpoint, why not? So I can see the world. Is there a uh, horse? There is a horse right there. Sweet. How convenient for me. Yeah, and if we have time, after we kill these next three, uh, or these next two, because we already killed one of them, after we kill these two pots of conspirators, I'll do the assassin's tomb. I feel like I'll have enough time. I feel like it's, it's not going to take very long. And, um, yeah, I don't know how far into this game I'm at at this point. I think maybe almost halfway. It's been so long since I've played. I know there's, like, two other big cities that I visit where I have to kill people, if I'm not mistaken, but... We spend a lot of time in the uh, last one, like half the game is in Venice, so once we get to Venice, uh, then we'll be spending a lot of time there. So I don't know, Maybe, like just the way things are looking right now, I don't think I can get this game done and Brotherhood done in a timely matter. Like I don't want to rush through the games, so there you go, just mentioning that again. We found Archbishop Salviati, he's barricaded himself inside that villa. Take some of my men. Use them to clear the fields. Then find a way over the wall so you can open the gates. Ah, command over my own army. A nice change of pace from the usual sneaking and stabbing. I like it. I agree, Ezio. I, I really do. With the help of Mario's mercenaries, subdue the Via guards and kill Francesco Salviati. Alright. Sounds like a whole lot of fun, I have to say, but in other news, I fractured my thumb, which is not my favorite thing in the whole world. It's not really a bad fracture. Um, what the fuck? People are, like, talking and stuff. I fractured my thumb. It's not that bad. I went to the doctor, and uh, she looked at the fracture. Like I took the x-rays and blah de blah She looked at the fracture, and she was like, oh, that's, that's nothing. And it was like a long, narrowish fracture that ran along the... Uh, the end bone in my thumb, I guess. Not the one that connects my thumb to my hand, but the the very tip of the thumb. Like, it got crushed while I was uh, playing hockey. I was fighting for the puck along the boards, and unfortunately, um, what the hell? Am I anonymous? I guess I was there for a second. Yeah, I got crushed while I was playing. I don't remember exactly what happened, and I really just don't know how exactly it happened because it all happened so quick. All I know is that I took off my glove and my thumb looked pretty nasty. So now it's kind of swollen. It just looks disproportionately large to the rest of my hand, which is weird. But I kind of have to wear a splint thing, so it makes maneuvering the mouse a little bit difficult sometimes. And it might look weird. So that's just to explain that to those of you who might notice that my mouse movements are strange. Let's go ahead and... Damn it. I want to select the hidden blade, please. This guy's being an asshole about shit. All right, he needs to die. He is dead next. What the hell? Oh, shit. What the fuck? That guy is attacking the fat dude now. What a nice guy. He helped me kill him. Yes, you better be dead, fat guy. I don't even know if he's just fat or, like, heavy set or, you know, beefy or what. But either way, he's dead. It doesn't matter. Holy shit. Ezio, like, fucking tossed him. Um, okay, I guess they just ran away. How do I get in here? Probably have to go onto one of these buildings and then jump on or some shit. But, uh, yeah, just thought I'd mention that. It happened during my game on Saturday, which was, what's today? Today's Monday, so it happened two days ago. And it's not the best thing in the world. It hurts, but it's not like a bad break, like I already mentioned. I find it kind of weird, though, because it's like, oh, that's, that's not a big deal. Like, it was a pretty lengthy, fra like, it goes almost along the entire thumb. But according to the doctor, it's not anything that I really have to worry about. Like, I don't have to get surgery or anything to fix it it'll just heal on its own but for the next few weeks it's gonna hurt like uh, a lot so if I like bang it up again or something then basically I'm gonna be having a lot of problems so not gonna be playing any more hockey I'm gonna miss a few games there which kind of sucks and you need to die god damn it my timing for counters has been off this entire recording so god well you you're being a fucking asshole man no stop you know I'm just gonna beat some ass here I don't really care as fun as counters are, I just want to... Yeah, there you go. But yeah, there's that. It's definitely not the coolest thing in the world when I have a YouTube channel and, you know, I have to play video games on, like, a daily basis. I don't have to, but I mean... This is uh, pretty much my job at the time being, so... If anything is cumbersome and, like, makes that... Makes things more tedious or difficult than they need to be, then... 
That's not great. Basically, it mostly means I can't do any console stuff for a while, so I'm not going to be able to play any LEGO Batman for a, uh, a few weeks, I imagine. Well, not a few weeks. I could probably start using my thumb more by... Uh, okay, people are just talking and stuff. 